Hello everybody and welcome back. Today we are going to start book 13 and I didn't pick up the quest at the end of last episode because I wanted to wait and uh, speak with Elrond so we could do whatever it was he needed right away. I really like the look of this guy, Sigvert. His outfit is very very simple. He's a level 52 uh, rune keeper. Uh, and he's an elf. He's got the rag. You know what I think of when I see him? I think of a vampire for some reason. I don't know if that's the look he's trying to portray, but uh, it's very nice. I like it. Hello, Elrond. Book 13, Chapter 1. Bellany. These last days have been disturbing. The Council of Narchwil did not end as I would have chosen, but I will not deny Laird in the quest he desires. I fear, however, that he may depart Rivendell upon a rash course. Would you speak with him for me? Learn what course he intends to take, and his purpose. I do not believe that Narmaleth will ever be recovered, for a dark power dominates her mind. I sense the influence of a power greater than a single minor ring. Oh, interesting. You will find Lairdon in his quarters on the lower floor of my house. With your aid, I hope Lairdon will use greater wisdom in his choices. There he is. Hello, Lairdin. What can I do for you? You would know what course I have chosen to take? Very well. I told the Council that Nartua will never be reforged, but I believe that my own words may have been hasty. I do not believe now that the ring sank with Arvdui in the Ice Bay of Forchel. Ariel, one of the ship's crew, knew of Narchwell and its power. I do not think he would have allowed such an heirloom of my house to sink into the sea. For that reason, I will myself return to Forchell and seek the ring. You may attend me if you wish. Uh, then perhaps Elrond's concerns will be lessened. Oh, well, you know what? You, you make a good point there. Might you spare a moment of your time? The last Homley house is fast becoming a prison to me. I do not feel welcome here. Yet, on the other hand, I do not feel right leaving just yet. I fear if I leave these halls, I will never return, and I would not leave in such bitterness. Perhaps you would take a, my search until such time that I can leave here in good conscience? I know a dwarf who trades in the southern reaches of Forchell. Perhaps he might have some insight as to where you should begin the search. You can find Athi at Kalpakota in Tau Othran. He knows more about Forchell, if such could be said about anyone, than I. All right, Lairdin. We are going to help him out as much as we can. Misty Mountains, Angmar. Return to Capcota. All right, where is this dwarf at? Looks like he might be right up here. There he is. Dathi, excuse me. Dathi, <laughs> are you deep in thought? I need a word. It is hopeless. You say you come from Laird and Elf? Aye, he was here some time ago, seeking a lost ring or some such, but to no avail. Can you imagine hunting for a ring in the snows of Forchel? Nevertheless, 
His quest may not have been as foolhardy as I first believed. For men out of Angmar have moved through this region, and with them others that I have never seen before. They remind me of the men of Gondor, but stranger. They seek something here as well, and it may be that your quests are related. If you wish to find your lost ring, you must speak with the snowmen, the, the Lasseth, who call themselves the Lumivaki. This is their land, and they know it better than anyone. I suggest you speak with Lassie at Surikaila, for he knows best the mind of their chieftain. All right. So we need to speak to Lassie. And Lassie's over in that direction. Let's see if we actually can get over that way. Are you well today? No. So how far is this place? We didn't do a whole lot. Whoa! Okay. Hold on a minute. Way the heck over there. So... Okay, well. Off we go. Interesting, what is that place? Let's at least get the exploration for it if it shows us. Oh my god! The Angmarims are there. Okay. They're all over here. I need to... This is not cool. Oh no. I need to get on that road. Okay, well they're definitely in this area now. This does not bode well. I don't want to stop and waste my time. We gotta get to Lassie. Right. Interesting town. We're looking for Lassie. Let's let's pick up the stable master. Greetings, Etelaviras. <coughs> okay, let's see. Boy, there's all kinds of quests here. Oh, he's gonna be in the big house up there, maybe. Oh, gotta go this way. Okay, there's Maddie, Noria. Jamari. And Lassie. 
Why have you come here? You are a stranger here, a woman from the South. We do not see too many of your kind, and we welcome even fewer. Oh. The Lumiveki are troubled. We remember this Ivankavaki you speak of, this Lairdin. He came to the Lumivaki seeking a lost ring. It was a foolish thing, looking for a bauble in these lands. You should not be so foolish. The Vankavaki did not have the favor of Yerjana and barely escaped with his life from the dangers that we face here. Without the help of the Lumavaki, you would have no hope in finding your ring. And you will not have the help of the Lumavaki without the favor of Yerjana. If you wish to gain our chieftain's favor, you must perform three tasks for the Lumavaki. Only then May you speak with Yerjana. If you wish to learn of these tasks, speak with me again. All right, sir. What is it that you need? There are terrible things in the way, Stetile Virus. Sinny may have a task for you. You may find her on the outskirts of Surikala. All right, so we need to talk to Sinny. Shadows fall upon us out of Angmar. Seek out Emily across from the Steam Lodge. He may have a task for you to perform that will help you obtain favor. All right. You should also speak with Jamari at Surikaila near to the Lodge. He will guide you upon your path. All right. Thank you, sir. I will be back once I have completed that. Head on across. Get lost in this place. Don't know my way around. Here we go. Jomari. Hello, Jomari. I was told that you might be able to set me on my path. Do you honor the traditions of those you know not? Well, I try to. You are a stranger to the Lumizeki. In wisdom have you been sent to me, and only with wisdom will you earn the favor of the Lumivaki. You will earn the favor of wisdom, which I will confer upon you after you have completed my task. All right, sir. Look next to me. There. You will find things of importance to the Lumavaki, things that help us to survive in these cold lands. Put these things in their proper order and then return to me. How will you know what the proper order is? Through wisdom, of course. Warmth is of great importance in these frozen lands, so fire is a boon companion. Even more important is water, for without water, there is no life. Once you have fire and water at your disposal, you have done much. But do not rest yet. You must then have stout weapons to protect yourself, but first obtain food enough to lend yourself the strength to wield them. And before you obtain any of these necessaries, a, a wanderer in these lands must have clothing warm enough to protect him. Clothing, water, fire, Food and weapons. Awesome. All right, I think I got the correct order, sir. The Vintervin speaks your name. Indeed. 
That is the correct order. You listened with wisdom, so I will confer the favor of wisdom upon you. This alone will not gain you the favor of your jana, but it is a strong beginning. Well, thank you, sir. Okay, so we finished that one. So now we got to talk to either Emily or uh, Simi. And uh, we're going to find this way. Which is going to be Emily. Here. Hello, Emily. The shadows in Angmar have been stirred against us. You're seeking the favor of the Lumivaki? It is not a trifling matter, for we do not trust many of your kind. If you wish to gain favor with Yerjana, you must perform a feat of strength. For a long time, our hunters have sought the snowworm Paksukarva. Yerjana wished to make its tusk a great horn, but Paksukarva has eluded our hunters at every turn. Go forth and find it, and bring me its tusk, and you will have gained my favor. The snow worm was last seen among a group of other worms close to the bay. They roam southeast of here. All right, thank you. Ooh, we get to go hunt something. Southeast of here. This is that way. Okay. And the other person we need to speak to, I think, is right over there. Yeah, Sinny. But we'll take care of Sinny as soon as we find this... this worm. How far away? Not far. So it's not really pointing me in that direction. There's a lot of them right here. We're going to probably have to fight. A new deed. Today I'm running a, a precision stance. We haven't really had much chance to see if it's working out well. There he is, Paksukarva. Well, that was easy. <laughs> All right, we have to take it back. Get back fairly quickly. Actually, we might go ahead and see what uh, Cindy needs. Might be able to take care of two birds with one stone.
There she is. I am here to help. The waters have frozen early. So, you wish favor of the Yerjana, huh? Then you must gain his favor, and with that, I can help you. The Lumavaki Prize, many qualities, but one of the most important is endurance. Often, our hunters must survive the cold wilderness with naught but a dull knife and the garb upon their backs. If you can search out Umas, one of my finest trackers, you will gain great favor in the eyes of my people. Go into the wilderness and seek Umas. If you succeed, return here. He was last seen heading south along the road in Itama. Let's go turn this tusk in real quick. Emily, I have the tusk. How can we hunt in ice storms? You have succeeded in doing what the hunters of the Lumivaka have failed to do, and you have brought me the tusk. I grant you the favor of strength, though it will not alone be enough. Yes, I, I'm working on the third and final task. Thank you so much, sir. Okay. Armas is... here. Now we could ride all the way down here because it's right off the road or we can go to Pinty Peldot. I have been there and just ride up the road. Let's try that. That seems to be the quickest way. May I be of help to you? I need to go to uh, Pinty Peldot, please. That's not swift travel though. That's okay. I think he's going faster than my mount. So I think we're going to stop here. up over this way. He should be right here. <coughs> there! Ermus. Hello, Ermus. Oh, we don't need to talk to him. We just need to go back and talk to Sydney. But what we're going to do is we're going to ride on to uh, this place here. And I'm just going to let the uh, horse take me back from the town. Because it's right up this way. It's not that far at all. It is a brisk day, is it not? Nope. No fast travel. Unfortunate. All right, everybody, I'll be back.
I'm just gonna dismantle it here and take a shortcut. I love the sound of the ice cracking under the horse's hoofs. At least in my headphones, it's, it's... They did a great job on a lot of the sound effects in this game. I am back. The cold is too great this season. It takes much endurance and fortitude to survive in the cold wilderness with so little. I grant you the favor of endurance. Thank you, Sinny. All right, we have completed all of the quests. We have all of the favor that we need. Now we can talk directly to Yerjana. <laughs> So we need to go back in in the town and into the big hut. Hope the elder will help us. Hello, Yojana. Greetings, Etelaviras. Welcome, woman of the south. You have shown great worth in the eyes of the Lunavaki, and have gained my favor. How may we be of help to you? Oh, thank you, sir, for your time. Uh, I come with a very important matter. We must speak, Etelaviras. Hmm. You are not the only one to come seeking our help to find this ring. Why is it so important? No, do not speak of it. I fear it will only bring a black wind upon us. First came the Von Havaki, Lairdin, and then came you. But another awaits an audience with me. He makes powerful claims. You should know the claim he lays upon the ring. However, we will wait until you are prepared. Oh, I am prepared, sir. I am prepared. Who could it be? Iryene, the chieftain of Surikile, desires to aid the free peoples of the south in their hunt for Narquil, the ring of Amarthiel. But he fears the threats of Mordrumbor. You are a stranger to the Lumiveki. Let us gather the elders and meet with this emissary from Angmar. A storm gather, an evil wind blows. Is that Emily's here, Cinny? 
I have no time for insignificant fools. More Dremor. What is your business here? You have an ill air about you. <laughs> an ill air indeed. The wind, air, and water are all servants to the iron crown of Angmar. Speak your peace, then be gone. I will not have my enemies walk freely through my land. Enemies? <laughs> Nay, thou art wrong. It is Bellany, the enemy of Angmar and the Great Eye, who has brought me to thy lands. If thou were to deliver me, mine enemy, a great friendship could be made between us. Uh, leave now, and speak no more of your falsehoods. I do not treat with my enemies, much less the Kiara of my enemies. Thou hast made a foolish choice, beast-born cur. Hold your tongue, or I will remove it. Depart and do not return. If thou refuse, I will take it and the heads of your people as payment for thine insolence. Didst thou truly believe that thou could challenge me? Oh, I will challenge you. Oh my god! Let me fight him! Oh! I will return, and when I do, I expect all to be done as I have commanded. Defy me! And you will share thy fate with Bellany. Oh! Oh! Is he okay? He is not okay. He's dead. Oh, Yuzana. This is bad tidings indeed. Come, we must seek shelter. You are a stranger to the Lumileki. And so you have it, woman. The servants of the Iron Crown stand against you. An end must be put to the evils of Angmar. But my people will not help you as long as this shadow looms over us. There is one, however, who may. Okay. There is a Nakja, a seer, who dwells outside the village. She is powerful and does not fear the Lord of Storms. She may help you find your ring. You will find Saija at Nakikolo, northwest of Kurulirai. That is on the western edge of the Ice Bay. She is haughty and proud, but you may find her an ally against Mordrumbor. Go and seek the wisdom of the ages. All right, everybody, we are going to leave the episode here today. Next time, we will go and speak to Saija. Please give a like and subscribe. Hope to see you next time. Take care, everybody. Bye-bye.